Hey, welcome back to Chaplain's Corner. I'm here, you're here, glad you're here. Like many of you, I do a fair amount of writing and other work on my computer and iPad. Whether it's creating content like these weekly messages or putting together flyers and brochures, these tools have become an important part of what I do. And my favorite feature of the software that I use is the ability to undo mistakes I make. Sometimes I don't like something that I type and need to erase it all quickly, so I hit Control Z. Sometimes I goof up and delete something that I didn't mean to. Undo becomes my best friend in those moments. But every once in a while, something happens, or if I'm being honest, I do something stupid, and undo is just isn't an option. It's grayed out in the menu, and I'm stuck with whatever situation I've created for myself. I can hit Control Z all I want, but nothing changes. What I've done just can't be undone. Unfortunately, this happens in real life too. I hear all the time about folks who make choices they can't unmake, and they, or more often their families, are left to deal with the consequences of those choices. And those situations are always so sad to me. So the next time you think that you have no other choice, please consider the possibility that you'll soon wish you could undo whatever it is you're thinking about doing. And just because you can't think of any other options, that doesn't mean one, none exist. Ask someone else to weigh in. They may see a solution that you just can't see right now. Some decisions are final and shouldn't be made lightly, if at all. Ask for advice before you find yourself wishing that your life had a control Z feature because it doesn't. If I can help, I'm available literally anytime. Be well.